uh, a stable, selective, and precious metal-free catalyst has been developed by researchers in the U.S. and Canada for the conversion of waste carbon dioxide into synthesis gas. The catalyst, created using ordinary sugar, shows promise for the production of valuable industrial chemicals from captured carbon in future chemical refinery. Synthesis gas, a crucial mixture of carbon monoxide and hydrogen, is essential for um, uh, producing industrial chemicals like ammonia and methanol. Traditional methods of producing singers such as steam reforming of methane or uh, gasification of coal have large carbon footprints. However, the reverse water gas shift process which reduces carbon dioxide to carbon monoxide using hydrogen, offers a more sustainable alternative. Uh, the researchers at Northwestern University and the University of Calgary discovered that a catalyst made from table sugar and ammonium molybdate resulted in nanocrystallites of cubic molybdenum carbide with a carbonaceous layer and interstitial atoms. This catalyst showed high selectivity to carbon monoxide and retained its efficiency for 500 hours on strain. So, uh, the development of this catalyst marks a significant step towards commercializing a more efficient and sustainable method for converting waste carbon dioxide into useful industrial chemicals. Uh, this research could lead to a reduced carbon footprint in CO2 conversion processes and contribute to the creation of fossil fuel-free refineries uh, by 2050 stability and efficiency of this catalyst under harsh operating conditions are currently being investigated for future industrial applications. This breakthrough in catalyst development demonstrates the potential for a more environmentally friendly approach to producing essential industrial chemicals. With further research and development, this catalyst could play a critical role in reducing carbon emissions and advancing towards a more sustainable uh, future. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more updates on this exciting development in Catalyst technology.